Honourable Senators, we have all seen the horrific images broadcast from Ukraine, the record of a people under siege. Reports daily speak of thousands killed, thousands more wounded, the bombing of schools, of a children's cancer hospital, apartments and other buildings obliterated, while hundreds of Ukrainians are trapped in bunkers beneath, of unspeakable horrors on the streets of Bucha. After seeing these images, after President Zelensky's heartfelt address to our Parliament, it is impossible not to be moved. We all want to help, and we all feel helpless. In this kind of chaotic emergency, medical assistance is badly needed. That is why a group of Canadian MPs and Senators, including Senator Larry Campbell and I, have paired up with Health Partners International of Canada, a Canadian charity licensed by Health Canada that handles and distributes medical supplies into crisis zones like this one. Supplied by med major medical and pharmaceutical partners, HPIC is working in partnership with Canadian assistance medical teams to deliver humanitarian medical kits into needed regions in and around Ukraine. For a sponsorship cost of $600, each medical kit contains about 600 treatments, a value of about $6,000 per box. The current medical kits to Ukraine contain supplies like antibiotics, antihypertensives, anti-inflammatories, analgesics, products to treat dermal infections, asthma, heart conditions and first aid. HPIC has set a goal to mobilize 400 medical kits for Ukraine and refugee camps in neighboring countries in the next few weeks, a donation target of $240,000. So many of you have charities that you do support generously, but we ask you to consider this one. If many MPs and Senators donated to this cause, we could make a huge impact. Honourable Senators, it is an extraordinary privilege for us to sit in this Chamber of Democracy. Recently, five Ukrainian Members of Parliament travelled here to Parliament to show Canada how critical it is that Ukraine receives more help. I was able to meet them. They were all moms who had to leave their kids behind in Ukraine to travel to Canada. One MP received an air raid siren notification on her cell phone during her Parliament Hill meetings notifying her that her child would not be going to school that day, but instead to a bomb shelter. It's unimaginable. Honourable Senators, let us as Canadian parliamentarians join arms to help ease the pain of the Ukrainian people at this dire time when they need it the most. If you are able, please donate a medical kit at hpicanada.ca or by contacting Senator Campbell or me. It's a great way to make a really meaningful contribution for the people of Ukraine. Thank you.